Hi guys, welcome to another episode of Art in the Network. Today we're going to talk about three different ways of shaking. The first one is called the dry shake, which we use when we're working with egg whites or with cream. Uh, then we're going to do the classic shake with ice, chili drink, and then we're going to do the double shake. It's very good for a busy bar uh, and you try to improve your working speed. To present to you these techniques, we're going to make a classic sour. When you're working with egg whites, you really want a nice foamy top. So you're going to take the other part of the shaker, you're not going to use ice, and you're going to connect them the right way, just like this. One side is right, the other one is corner. That way, when you're shaking, it's easier to release them. When you're shaking with egg white, without ice, you really want to break down the egg whites into your drink, so you're going to shake it really, really hard. Everybody has their own shaking techniques. Important is you go make a one and fourth motion. Now we're going to shake it again with ice. Fill up the shaker. Attach them again. Make sure it's sealed. And shake it about eight to 10 seconds. Release it right away. Taste your drink. Now you guys know the basic ways of shaking. We're gonna move on to another technique called the double shake. It is used in bars where it's busy and you need to make several drinks at the same time and you want to increase your working speed. So I already have my glasses pre-chilled and my cocktails prepared in my shake. I'm gonna add some ice. Put the small tins on, just like we previously explained. Make sure they are tight and give a double shake. Whenever you lose them, they're ready for straining. These were three ways of using the shaking technique.